hello 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 everyone welcome back to my channel and in today's video i decided to show you guys how you can do threading hairstyle but at this time i decided to do bigger section because in my previous videos i used to do very small section and today i decided to do something different like go with bigger section which took me very short time i think it's around two hours to braid my entire head if you're my oldest subscriber thank you so much honey for coming back but if you're new to this family you're welcome my name is glory mtui before you leave kindly hit the subscribe button below give this video a big thumbs up if you find this video is useful and don't forget to share with your loved ones i started to braid my hair in back section of the camera and if you want to make clean and good sections first you need comb just like mine with long tail this is so easy if you have this kind of comb like it's so easy to section your hair and as you can see i just pass through section and then i make sure i hold um other hair which i'll not work with at this round and after that you also need gel or hair wax and i'll be using all sun the good thing or how to use this hair wax if you don't have any experience it is this hair wax helps you to make clean and neat section especially after you part your hair the first time you need to apply some hair wax and then to do the line again to get clean and neat section as you can see after i apply some gel like all the hairs slick well so it's even more easy for me to part the second time so quickly i'll go ahead and part and then after this as i said i'll go ahead with bigger section but not such big but not smaller like i used to do in my previous videos first of all you may decide any size of the sections you want and i'll be using this doom doom wool you might decide to cut any length depending on how long you want your twist to be but for me i only want the size up to my shoulder especially here is summer it's so hot and i don't need like a long hair for real because he is humid so long hair absolutely not for this season okay so after i cut i cut fewer wool at first because i'll braid back and then i'll cut again to braid in the middle and in front this size is only for front up to here middle and up to my anchor it's back sections i hope that it will be easy for you to know the length of the wool you have to cut to avoid wasting too much wool each section i use six strand plus this one i use to wrap so total i have seven strand in each section yeah so after you wrap them together you have to make sure both sides they are even and then this is how i will hold the wool and then of course you have to apply some gel if you have and then hold the hair together with your natural hair and then that one piece you fold that is the piece you'll use to wrap on your hair of course no specific amount like how many times you should wrap but then wrap till you feel like your hair is well secured you hold your hair well and your hairstyle is gonna last longer and then after that to tuck your hair in well apply some gel on your natural hair and then tuck your hair well and when you're tucking make sure you are rolling so that when you are starting making twists you'll get clean and neat twists this style it's so easy very very easy for beginners even if you don't know how to braid trust me if you can try this method once twice i'm telling you People that are going to be surprised because you'll come out with something very nice so after you make twists depending on how many twists you want you may put maybe five three and then pull the wool 
so that your twists can be not too closer, not too far from each other. This hairstyle called fake twists. So after you make twists, just pull slowly, slowly. Make sure you're pulling slowly, slowly because you don't want to hurt your scalp. So do gentle. And then in the end of the, your wool, take only one piece and secure twice to make sure you are section is well secured as it as you can see like in back i do part the hair so here each line i'm going to follow previous line section that that's this is how i usually do if you have been here for a while so again take your seven strand wrap on your natural hair well and after I feel like your, your hair is well secure, you wrap enough, not too long though. Then apply some gel on your hair so that you can tuck in your hair easily. And then roll, then start to make twists. When you make five, six, then you have to pull one side of the wool up and other side pull down so that you can get the twist i'm talking about and then keep going just the same way and another thing i want to tell you guys is to braid this hair took very few amounts of wool to braid my entire head i used only two bundles or two bags of this dome wool i don't know it's dome or doom i don't know whatever i used two packs of doom wool Another important thing I forgot to tell you guys is when you are rolling, you have to make sure you are rolling your wool opposite direction with the direction you will start to wrap using that one strand you fold. Does it make sense? The direction you will roll all the wool together except the wool that you fold. You have to make sure they are going in different directions so that you can get twists. Otherwise, you'll not get twists. And if you're asking like, should you use only this kind of wool? No, honey, you may also use any kind of wool. You may use baby wool. You may use Brazilian wool. You may use this kind of wool. The results, they are very similar. I keep going pull resize the twist keep going just like this way right you may decide to go ahead and to burn the end of the wool but usually i don't like to burn the ends of the wool whatever i braid wool because it's so easy to stuck on some clothes material and i don't like that so i feel more comfortable when i go ahead with this hairstyle without burning the end but then if you want to burn the end then go ahead and do that and guys, this is the final result for today's video. Hopefully you enjoy watching and you get something. And guys, let me know what do you think about this hairstyle. Or if you have any idea or any hairstyle you wish I can do video for it, kindly leave your comments in the comment section and I will make sure I reply all of the comments as much as I can. I love you guys so much and I will see you soon on my next video. Bye-bye.